Hello, and here we are today underneath the Wembley Arch at one of the most instantly recognisable venues in the football world. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Milan facing Real Madrid. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. the Milan team Mike Mignon begins in goal Davide Calabria plays with Teo Hernandez in the wide defensive areas and the starting role and attack is handed to Olivier Giroud And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And the main goal-scoring threat provided today by Karim Benzema. And the contest begins. Mendy. This is Kroos. Attacking possibilities for Real. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? Yeah, he's the club's leading scorer and he's so difficult to negate. But I'm sure these defenders will have a game plan for him. Whether it works or not, we'll have to wait and see. Well, possibilities inside the box. Just couldn't get it through. Modric on to Benzema Benzema and now Rodrigo superbly read and executed I must say this looks promising firing it in able to get a body in the way he successfully got past him now potential danger and still danger here and he clears it out of harm's way Casemiro oh that's an interesting pass the outcome is a goal kick here Modric. Lucas Vasquez. And the keeper taking care of the situation. Mendy. Now with Benzema. Vinicius Jr. And a good-looking ball. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong.
And room to roam on the wing for Milan. Giroud. He must finish. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Trying to pick out a teammate. And there it is, the opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. But the finish is so easy. He's given far too much time and space. He doesn't even have to jump. Poor defending, you have to say. So Real restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? Benzema. Course. Giving it a try. Well, decent effort, but not troubling the keeper too much. Well, the stats tell you everything. The chances have been few and far between, and they haven't tested the goalkeeper anywhere near enough. If they want to get something from this game, they're going to have to improve in the final third. That's eyes for goal. And a goal. The keeper couldn't stop it. Real Madrid on turns. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 here. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. Diaz. Well, far from the ideal pass. The first half here comes to an end. Well, he has plenty of battle scars and he knows how to lead a line, Karim Benzema. It's going pretty well for him. Well, Derek, he plugged away in that first half, making run after run without too much success. But eventually he got his reward, and what an important goal it was. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far, and now the second half is underway. Modric, Rodrigo, the ball with Luka Modric, Force. can they forge ahead? And the goal won't stand, offside the decision. Well that was always going to be brought back, it was a decent effort though. Brahim, perfect example of how to execute a slide tackle. Now let's see if something comes of this. And thumped away. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end.
Casemiro. And now Rodrigo. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. Well, he's gone into the book. Well, he was late and he deserved a booking for that. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Course. Now, Eder Militao. No nonsense clearance. Well, I must say he acquitted himself well under pressure. And the cross is very much on. Plattered away. A foul, but advantage played. Counter attacking very much an option. And still looking for space. Passing it around, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Tremendous block. Getting forward. Excellent save from Thibaut Courtois. Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here. So athletic. Casemiro. And fed forwards. Well, it was a menacing attack, but tidied up. Course making quite a bit of progress. Vinicius Junior. And players waiting in the centre. Keeping it moving dynamically. Really vital interception here. Wasteful from Milan. But into the keeper's gloves. Sandro Tonali. Can they hit on the break? Wonderfully weighted pass. He's in behind the defence here. And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Well, not cleared away completely. Danger averted for now. Could be a chance to break here. Well, it petered out. Mendy. And Valverde. On the attack in the closing phase. Modric. The ball with Lucas Vasquez. He's given us away.
There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes, and now both sides will make personnel switches. And the referee brings this match to a close. Not the result Real Madrid were looking for. I wonder what you made of this. Well, Derek, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. But in the end, they will not be happy with the defeat and the manner of it.